Hello, beautiful people of the internet. My name is Ryan, and welcome back to our Nuka World DLC playthrough of Fallout 4. It's episode number 43, I believe. We're here in the Cappy Cafe. That's what it's called. Cappy Cafe, where we just uh, took care of some some pack, disciple, and operator uh, raiders. And, hey there, and they don't Mr. need Boss, taken care Lauren of anymore. Sells the drinks. Ever again. Probably want to talk to her. Yep, I will. Keith, how's it going? Oh, look what do you got to say? Always oh, good to see the boss. You're free now, man. You're you're you've got that around your neck, but you can actually get rid of it if you want. I don't mean to brag, but I've been uh, I've been taking care of uh, I've been taking care of the raiders. So we are, as if you've seen the episodes before this, we're very close, very very close to the end. I'm guessing. Um, and I need to decide whether or not we are. Clean the raiders out of here, didn't you? What exactly our finish line is for this series. <laughs> so. What do you have? <clears throat> so I'd like to talk to got? Laura. I got Lauren. Lauren. This rowdy bunch can get their hands on. Okay. From fine spirits to rot gut that'll put a fire mm. in your belly. What Sounds yummy. Mean? Disgusting. I'll think about it. All right then. Okay, and that's it. Great, Lauren. Uh, you're you're incredible with words. I really thought maybe we'd have more of a conversation than that. So. Basically, trying to decide exactly what the finish line is here. Um, is it gonna be something to do with uh, like finding all the all the cappies, or is it not? I don't really know. Um, I do want the star core, so that involves going back to power and getting the power uh, turned back on in the plant. I believe you took on oh, that's just all those raider gangs. You must be the bravest person in the whole Commonwealth. Well, uh. Well, Keith, I was kind of in a weird situation where I almost had to. Um, it's a funny story. Let me tell you how my life got turned up right upside upside down. How's that go? Casual head hanging out over there. My dog is sitting here like, hey, give me attention. Are you okay? What's going on? Uh, okay, so that's the Cappy's Cafe. Uh, kind of a letdown. <laughs> Not a lot going on there. That's fine, though. So, I think we're off to the power plant. Um, and after that, we will see. We will see. I have turned on active the uh, the quest for the cappies, just so that hopefully it directs me to where they can be found. If that makes sense. Um, yeah. Like, like, so it shows up as uh, little markers on the, on the game. <clears throat> on the HUD. Um, okay, so one other thing. I don't know where this key is going to be to the power plant rooftop thing. Um, however, the, uh, oh shoot, wrong button. Oh shoot, there we go. However, we've also run through the thing like twice, so we should be able to find it pretty quickly, my guess is. Um, this is uh, just a reminder, we had to look this up the other day to determine why we couldn't get into the roof and it turns out you either have to complete open season which we just did or the other one um or you have to like go into the uh commonwealth and start giving settlements to the raiders which is not my not my thing so and then you can then you can finally turn the power back on so we'll speed run the power plant looking for this key and then hopefully get things turned on have no problems i don't know Maybe that'll, uh, maybe that'll quickly, maybe that'll be super quick. All right, speed around the power plant. You ready? I'm going to, I'm going to do this. I'm going to make jokes about speed running it and then not, I'm going to miss it somewhere. And then y'all are going to be pissed and I'm going to be upset with myself. I don't know that you guys will be pissed. I'll be upset with myself for missing it somewhere. Uh, and of course, I could always just look it up where the key goes, but I'm not about to do that unless I have to. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay, so we still have down here. I don't remember which one's uh, the dead end. So we still have down from that one. That room. 
This is the dead end here. There's like, is this where the key is? It's my guess, right? We originally thought that it was very likely that it was in this room based on the fact that this room has nothing else going for it. Turns out, still not in this room. All right. There you go. Oh, we are really low on health, by the way. I don't know why. Probably that last fight. All right. Also, we have no armor because we uh, fucked it up trying to kill all of the uh, the leaders. All right, so sloth room. The sloth room. I'm going to know this place better than any other place in the entire game, I swear. All right, that's all connected. Which means we can go this way. Nothing there. Go this way and still not see anything. Okay. Okay, so now we gotta go down. Speed run, speed run, speed run. I just missed something right there. I did. <laughs> Why is he there? Wait. I don't know. Am I tripping? I think I might be tripping. Why is a patch scaver there? A pack scaver there. Because I don't think we encountered any any pack people or anything over here. Also, last time we were here, we had not done the... Uh, uh oh. Can't find it so far. Um, we hadn't done the quest. Am I on drugs? I don't think that that body was there. Okay, so... Not good, y'all. I don't see it yet. Could it be in here? Don't see it. Um, I don't. I don't remember seeing the pack scaver. I'm sure it's not a big deal. It just and he wasn't looted, which is also weird. You know me. All right, so here is probably a good guess is in there on that desk. I know this game at all. What this kind of is, is like a test of how well I know the game, which is not that well, but better than I did 200 episodes of Fallout 3 ago, um, which is like, where would the loot be located? And my guess was going to be this desk. One of my many guesses, <laughs> none of which have been right so far. All right, to the roof we go. All right, I'm gonna get my Google ready. I'm not actually gonna Google it, but what's called? What's it called? Like power plant key, uh, Nuka World. Just in case we gotta find it. I hit Google, but I haven't looked at the screen yet. I hit search. Does anyone else who uses an iPhone accidentally search the App Store way more than they would ever want to? Listen, Apple. I don't want to search the App Store. I don't know that I've ever wanted to search the App Store. Maybe once or twice. But not nearly as often as I accidentally hit the button when I'm trying to hit search for web. And I think that you know this, Apple. I just think you really want me to keep going to the App Store. You know what? I don't appreciate it. I was going to make that jump uh, over to the other side, but that seems kind of risky for no gain. Like if I fall and I have to run through this whole place again, I'm going to be pissed. 
All right, so where the F is it? Did we have it the whole time? Okay. I'm not the smartest cookie that's ever lived. Not even close. Sweet. But what? Did we have it the whole time? That is mildly confusing to me. We're going to turn the power on, obviously, in two seconds. Ooh, I thought, um, no, 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 the Star Core is not here, right? Or is that it? Nope, it's a Nuka Cola victory. Star Core, I think, is back in Galaxy Zone. Alright, let's do some reading. Once we turn the power on. Galactic Zone. As per management direction, all inc incidents require proper documentation. Reliability reasons. Incident reports. Main power failure by Buckley. Lighting test for upcoming Halloween spooktacular event. Trip to main breakers. Employees would like to note that repeated complaints have been entered regarding the power load of said event. <laughs> Unexpected full reboot. Auto. After hours system failure resulting in full reboot of all power relays. It was an employee error. <clears throat> Sustained voltage sag. You can voltage my sag, I don't know about that one. 90 second sag resulting in electrical mechanical malfunctions across galactic zone. Vault traced, fault traced to vomit on exposed wiring on the handy scrambler. You can handy my, you can scramble my, Never mind. Uh, recommend that splash guards be installed on all critical systems. God, that's disgusting. A forced shutdown by redacted. Critical failure of redacted due to series of events starting with redacted, redacted, redacted. No major faults can be found. Incident, incident was mischaracterized as a class 1 failure when it was, was in fact merely a class 7 event. Park operation can continue as normal. I'm sure it can. I'm sure it can. Okay, can I file a new report? Probably not. Cool. Let's hit this button. I feel like they do it here so that you can see. Yes! Cool. I think this is as close to an end credits of Nuka World as we're gonna get. I'm into it. I like it. I mean, I'm into it. I'll, I'll celebrate a little bit. I'm obviously still not in love with the with the way this whole series. Like, I don't feel any really romantic connection to any of these places right here. But, you know, we got there. Uh, we have to jump off now, right? Oh, uh, it won't let us? Nope. All right, well, let's jump off this way. Now we go to Galactic Zone. And while we are fast traveling to Galactic Zone, I'm going to be really honest with you. I'm going to go check to make sure that my dog's not eating something he's not supposed to. Be right back. One hundred and ten percent he was eating something he wasn't supposed to. Puppies, man. We did so good, and then all of a sudden we did so bad. He's like, he's a great boy. He's a, he's a good boy. All, all dogs are good boys. However. Attention. Went from, oh God. We're happy to announce that Mad Mulligan's minecart ride has Went from not eating anything uh, that he wasn't supposed to, to eating everything that he's not supposed to. Okay, so power's on. So I should be able to like go up or something now. Is I think my understanding of the situation. Somehow. <clears throat> Excuse me. I 
still need one more, right? I still need one more. Okay, so how do I get up? I wonder how this is supposed to work. It's been a little bit since we've been here, you know? Oh! dog is farting guys will you just let me record in peace please okay um so why will that not go up we read all these already I don't know what to do here. Yo, what the hell? Did we never do this? Did we ever do this? I swear the movement system in this game sometimes makes me get sick. If I hit this, am I going to drop super far? Is that another star core spot? Oh, dude. This is so cool with the lights on. I can't believe that actually goes back and forth. Last off. Wow. Yo! Oh! Okay, that's chill. <laughs> okay, so there's one more star core. I think we did do that actually. So, but apparently I've misunderstood how to get up there. So, that leaves us with a debate here. So I think, here's, here's my honest take. I think we're at the place right now. Here's my thing. I think at this point, what we're doing, I think we're done. I think we're we're technically done with Nuka World. Anything left that we do is a bonus. And for that reason, I am allowing myself to Google where the last star core is. <laughs> and we may Google the cappies depending on how much time we have. Um, star core galactic zone last one. So, I think what we can consider this, we can consider this to be the last episode. And what I might actually do here is just make this episode as long as it takes to find all of the cappies. I don't know. I should probably not do that. Sorry, I'm talking out loud now. We'll end this at its normal time. And just keep going, because we don't know if we'll find we'll run into something else. Um... Okay. Okay, so it says that let me let me read to you what it says. The final Star Corps is on the top level of Starport Nuka. 
uh, which is the thing, whatever it is, Starport Nuka. It is only accessible after completing the main story quest to restore power to Nuka World. It's up there. So, how? How? <laughs> this is the question. <laughs> the only question is how. Is it bugged? I hate that that's my go-to assumption, because I just want to assume that the game is working. I just want to assume that it works. Listen, power's on here, so... Get your shit a moving, please. Do we have a hidden cap in this area, by the way? I think we technically do. How do you get to the top floor of Starport Nuka? Oh. You know? I will Google that too if I need to. Let's see. It says you have to. All it says are. <laughs> it says ride the uh, ride the elevator. Ride the central elevator in Starport and you get to the viewing platform at the top. I've done that. So okay. Here's my thought. My one thought here. Maybe we have to talk to the guy about the fact that our uh, that the power's back on. You know, the electrician? It's the only thing I can think of. I don't know. I'm sorry that this is less smooth than I thought it would be. I really am. Um, the guy selling chems is a little off. Chip. Chip. No more raiders. If this Power's is a back dream, on, though. Don't wake me up. You really taught those raiders a lesson. Okay. I don't know then. All right. I'll check that between episodes. In the meantime, we're going to go looking for cappies. Uh, okay. Well... Let's go, let's go back there and try and find the, uh, the last one. Remove that marker. In Galactic Zone. Find the next hidden cappy. And then, uh, and we'll just keep cranking. I don't know how many more we have left, but. I guess while we're on a loading screen, I could technically Google it. Um, yeah, I don't know if it's just bugged or, or what's going on, but it's a bummer because I really want that, uh, really want that special armor. All right. So, uh, how we'll do this is Fish man's revenge. Not recommended for children under five. We're going to use the map HUD. It's like behind that thing is what it looks like. That way. No, it's talking like behind Starport Nuka. Okay. Well. 
spend a little bit of time looking and go from there. It might be in Vault Tech, I don't know. Okay, so we're looking for the paint on the walls. Looks like it might be that way. We're just I remember looking for this one actually. Um back in the day. It was right around here that we were looking. Could be up a couple levels, could be I don't know, inside Vault Tech. My honest guess is if we can't see it around here, it's probably in Vault Tech. You know? Remember this whole area back here? I forgot about this. Um, I think it's actually slightly that direction. So, hmm. Been an eye out for anything we can see. Nothing so far. Wait, we've never been in this door? That's funny. There we are. Mmm, yum, some bottle caps. And a plunger. And nothing other than that. Okay, see, now I think we're too far this direction. Well, let's go up a level. No way it's in the room, right? Let's go up a level. Keep checking. It's interesting that it disappears from your HUD. It's kind of a uh, a bummer. It's kind of cheeky, you know. It's like you thought you knew where you were going. You did not know where you were going. I'm not dumb, right? That's the only button. Shooting it usually works, right? Okay, so from here, it was like right here. Yeah, I really think we gotta go down into Vault Tech, maybe. Go up this real quick. Also run along this section. Never been over here before. That thing's upsetting me. Can you tell? Can you tell I'm actually very upset about that? It's right here. All right. Uh, so. See, that feels too far. I don't know, we're gonna pop in there real quick.
first. <laughs> you think the hidden cappy's up top? There's a second hidden cappy over here. All right, I have to go back. First thing I googled about this star core is that the button is inside of the elevator. Elevator. Are you? Oh, at least I'm not the only one. At least I'm not the only one. Is this? Oh, I'm gonna throw something. I love feeling so dumb. There's a second button. There's a second button. I'd be really upset if I wasn't uh, just stoked that I think there's a quick answer. There's a second button. That is the button I'm supposed to hit. That is the button. Oh, thank God for Google. We're doing it. <laughs> I bet there's a hidden cappy up here. And at least there's a star core. So I guess at this point, the, uh, the episode's going on. Star core. You'll love to see it. No hidden cappy. All right. I don't know. Who cares? We got the star core. That's what matters. Cool views, bro. Can I fall out of- <gasps> Oh my fucking heart. Can I fall out of this, he says. I just really wanted to get down to the ground really quickly. Turns out you can fall out of it. God, my heart is beating so fast. What a semi-anticlimactic way to do this, by the way. Um, we are, we do officially have the last star core after having to Google because it's slightly confusing, I would argue. I would argue that it's not very distinct, that button at the back, and they offer you a fake button, which apparently just calls the elevator to the floor. Uh, protocol display case access, let's do it. Also, we leveled up. We've leveled up. All right. Would you look at that? Wow. Mark five, Mark five. Oh, Jesus. Okay. We're going to get out of ours right here. Wow, this is a cool one. It does look cool, too. This Nuka-Cola Quantum right there. God, that's sexy. That is real sexy. Oh, yep, let's look at inventory. A lot of inventory space. Ooh, buddy. Okay. We've done it. The final nuclear core. We're going to have to call it star core. We're going to have to call it an episode there. Thanks so much for watching this episode of our nuclear world DLC. We'll be back in the next episode where we might hunt some cappies. We might not. We'll see. All right. Thanks so much. We'll see you soon tomorrow. Uh, same time, same place. Bye-bye.